Hey everyone, Gameplay Vids 24 7 here. Welcome back to my Time Warpers gameplay walkthrough series for the PC. Ladies and gentlemen, we're jumping straight into today's episode. Look, everyone, I have a big, big video for you guys today. Uh, it's going to be probably around 30 minutes long, I'm hoping. We'll see how much uh, gameplay we can get out today. I have progressed so much since the last time I've spoke to you all. Pretty much, we managed to get to zone 1700. Now, if you guys don't know, in Time Warpers, zone 1700 is very, very good. Uh, we're getting up to those high brackets of levels now. We could have easily have pushed further if the convoy kept up. And if you guys don't realize or know what a convoy is, pretty much what the convoy is, it's the way of uh, everyone on their bikes at the same time and we're all killing the same zone together. So yeah, that's the way the convoy works. If I jump on my bike right now, as you can see, we're just sitting here, gonna automatically attack the enemies when they come out. So that's pretty much easy mode. We turn into like a robot sort of, and you can just leave this on all night, man. It's awesome. Now, right now I'm using the preset of, what is this? This is just the plasma rifle with epic fire rate, epic teamwork, epic critical chance, and epic damage. So that's pretty solid, dude. But I reckon what I might do is chuck on a launcher and we'll craft a, a launcher class here for us all. So we'll use splash and we'll use, what else can we use here? We have fire rate increase already on at the moment, so that's fine. We have the splash, what else can we do? We've got speed, no, we, don't, we can't use speed. Laser guidance, that could come in handy actually. Laser guidance maybe? Or would that be more, no, nah, maybe I won't use that actually. So, and we have cluster. Cluster's definitely the next one as well. So this is my rocket build right now. Fire rate, splash, damage, and cluster. So we're gonna be able to kick major ass right now. This has got a rock, man. Let's jump straight into it here, shall we? So just gonna spawn and destroy everything on the field right now. We are versing humanoids for the first time ever on camera, which is pretty neat. Uh, obviously, the enemies change throughout the heart of the stage as you go. So yeah, I was really shocked when I did see humanoids. I wasn't expecting it, I'm not gonna lie. But either way, it's awesome. If you guys have not picked up this game yet, I really recommend you do. It's an amazing game. It has so much content and it's still growing. That's what I love about Time Warpers, guys, okay? Uh, by the way, it is a fresh working week where I live. Uh, pretty much it is Tuesday and I absolutely hate it. <laughs> I wish I could just wake up, play games all day, but that is sadly not how real life is. So yeah, hopefully your day was better than mine, guys. But now we're home, playing games, which is always great. Let's quickly begin the level 230 boss, which is a crimson, where are we? We're in the crimson corridor. Should be able to take down this guy easily. Aced him, one rocket. Dude, that was the most easiest boss battle. Excellent, okay. Hey, and we got some players back here. They, they might need our help. I'll help you players, don't worry. See how you got a convoy coming through here, guys? There's a couple of people on their bikes. They're just sitting there relaxing. But yeah, they're, they're lower, lower tier levels, so we won't worry about them for now. I'm not even gonna worry about the, the butterflies for now, dude. I'm just rushing through. Just to show you guys how it is. So apparently I'm almost dead, by the way, which is very interesting. I only have two hearts left. I'm not used to fighting people that have guns. I'm just used to versing the drones, but obviously people with guns are a little bit different. But to try and strafe around here and avoid those bullets, which shouldn't be too hard, obviously. As long as we keep strafing around here, we should be okay. This is why I love the rocket launcher, though. Hang on, all these players are rocking up all of a sudden. Wow. That's good, it saves me time and effort though. I can actually stick with this convoy here if I want to. Let me just upgrade my turret to my weapons. There we go. You can upgrade your weapons with the hotkeys of uh, Z, X, and C, guys. So just <laughs> really raining hellfire down on the mobs right now. There's no real damage being dealt to me anymore. I do hope there's a healing base somewhere here. I really, really do hope so. I'm yet to see one. There might have been one. Oh, there it is. Dude, speak of the devil, awesome. Let me just heal up quickly. Just remember, there is healing bays around the levels. That's something you have to keep in mind, guys. Now, I got no idea what the hell is going on with my YouTube channel lately, but bloody hell, man. I've done a poll asking you viewers, and you can find it on my community tab on the channel if you're subscribed to me. I've done a poll asking you how many times do you guys actually see my video show up in your feed? Because you've got to think, I post every day, right? But I don't know who actually sees my video and who doesn't because I have 52,000 subscribers and you wouldn't think it with the views that I get. So 
I seriously believe something is wrong with my YouTube channel. YouTube seems to think otherwise, which is quite frustrating. Uh, but yeah, who knows? It could be just the games I'm playing. Uh, maybe I'm not keeping you guys entertained for long enough, but I'm obviously trying to change as much as I can. If you're watching this uh, at this point, thank you very much. I do appreciate it. Hopefully I can keep you entertained all the way to the end of the video. Now, the whole goal is for today's episode, though, is to show you guys all the new stuff I unlocked, which I think I did, didn't I? Pretty much went through all the, the perks and stuff. Let me just quickly check. So, we do have a large amount of perks here that we've unlocked. All of them are pretty much epic. Purple represents epic. Uh, we got fire rate, epic, splash epic, damage. I'll just, I won't say epic at the end of them. You know what it means. Bounce, laser guidance, teamwork, critical chance, critical multiplier, speed, multi-shot, uh, punch through, cluster, gold, and slow. So, that's pretty neat. Uh, the drone has, at the moment, fire rate, splash, cluster, and laser guidance because... The drone will automatically target enemies, okay, and what you'd want is to have laser guidance on. So when the when the drone looks at enemies, the rocket will follow where he's looking. So it's like heat-seeking missile, essentially, do you know what I mean? Uh, so he's got the rocket launcher on. The turret has the pulse pistol, because I, I think of him as like a sniper. So he's got fire rate, speed, damage, and critical chance. Can we change that for anything else, maybe? I don't know, I mean, there's slow there. I don't really care about that, though, I don't think. Uh... I think the, the turret's pretty solid right now. Maybe I don't need to do anything just yet. I think we'll leave him for now, guys. I like my build at the moment. I think it's actually going pretty well. So, yeah. Are we still... No, we can move on here from this zone. Awesome. Oh, okay. That's a big robot with a big chain gun there. <laughs> okay. Got to be careful. I don't get my ass handed to me right now. But, yeah. As I said, we're versing humanoids, so it is a little bit different. We're just going to try and constantly jump around here. Because I feel like if we stand still for too long, we end up getting owned. There is a blue butterfly and a red butterfly there, okay. Let's try and jump up this ramp if we can. Oh, there's a way up, okay. Awesome. We're trying to get that blue butterfly on the top there. Sneaky bugger. Oh! What damage because of that? I'm getting attacked from the UFOs. Got it, got the time butterfly there, guys. So I got the blue one, that's awesome. I've really been missing out on capturing these butterflies, haven't I? That's not good of me. But, oh, well, I can't be bothered right now. I just love cruising through the game pretty much at this point. I'd love to hear in the comments, guys, what you all think of Time Warpers. Please let me know. That's the question of the day. Do you guys like Time Warpers or you don't really care about it too much? I really, really want to know because I really enjoy this game heaps. Like, I can't stress it enough. This game is fantastic to play. Uh, it's just so bloody addicting and having a constantly online lobby where everyone can help each other out is awesome as well. I love playing with other people, of course. Just collected a blue butterfly there, by the way, which is great. And the red butterfly there also. Cool. So do I have to stay in this area now? This is the horde, isn't it? I don't have to stay here and fight anymore, do I? Surely not. No, I want to get out of here. Oh, a healing station. Sweet. Just lobbing my rockets down here while this guy sits on his little bike. So making his job a lot easier. <laughs> Alright, doing well. Can we go down here? No, we cannot. The zone's still not beaten. There's the red butterfly. I might as well try and nab the butterflies while I can, I guess. If I can see them anyway. If I can't see them, I won't worry, uh, won't worry about them. No need to. There's another red butterfly there. Got it. Excellent. I did get shot, though, because of that. That's a bit of a pain in the ass, but that's all right. So as you can see, all we really do in Time Walkers at this point is just jump around like a madman. Gotta love it. Gotta respect it, guys. Still can't get through just yet, though. Gotta take down these mobs. Done. Is it done? Yes, it is. Awesome. <laughs> Look, this is non-stop progression, man. I've progressed so much in the last three or four days. It's ridiculous. 1,700 guys is our zone. Like, it's crazy. Um, can I show you guys my skills at all? I don't know if I can show you my skills, can I? Time warp, time cubes. Yeah, here's my skills at the moment. So this is where I've invested all my points into. You guys can see here, just quickly. We've mainly gone into uh, automatic fire energy, dual wield energy, teamwork energy, critical chance energy. No, I'm really worried about them actually. Mainly, I'll just talk about the main ones. So automatic fire energy, dual wield energy, teamwork uh, energy, gold, rainbow wave chance. We've done a little bit there. Rainbow wave gold increase, yellow to rainbow, uh, click damage increase quite a bit there as well. Lots of uh, points into the progression tab at the bottom. Time cube is 49 out of 150. Time cube drop is 77 out of 200. Main ones I've also done here are the following. Teamwork, 
hover bike auto aim speed and hover bike movement speed with purchase active abilities as well as gold rush. So there you have it guys, a little bit of uh, upgrades to the turret as well. I'm currently sitting on a total of 31,000 time cubes. That's pretty good, man. Like we've made, as I said earlier, fantastic progression. Cannot complain at all really when it comes down to it. Should I take these idiots down quickly? Okay, that's done. Let me just grab the red butterfly. That's also done. Excellent. Gonna dodge these bullets. As you can see, having the rocket launcher really does help out a lot as well, because when you have cluster on uh, and the increased splash damage, it obviously helps out a lot. As soon as that rocket hits the floor, it kills anything around it. So you gotta think about that very carefully. You're essentially like building a, a mortar build. So think of yourself as like a portable artillery. Because as soon as your rocket hits the ground where enemies are, it's gonna kill anything around it with area of effect damage. So yeah, it's great. Just gonna try and upgrade my ability some more there. That's all done, awesome. As soon as they spawn, they die, dude. You just cannot get better than this. I do have my turret in the in the field here. It should be auto-targeting everything if I am correct. Yes, it is. A lot of red bullets here I'm trying to avoid. Nice, didn't get shot. Here comes another player now. Should I help him out? No, he's on a convoy, who cares about him? He's all right, he, he doesn't get damaged on that bike. Can we go through to the boss now? Yes, we can. All right, this is the boss, everyone. One shot, one kill. That's the end of the boss. Beautiful, thanks, game. Let's continue on here. What else we got going on around here, eh? There's a red butterfly at the top. Don't know if I can get to it. I can maybe leap from side to side, perhaps. Got the butterfly, awesome. Okay, it's 241 butterfly captured. So really, all I do at this point now is log in, leave my game on all night, and then, yeah, progress from that point onwards. Pretty good idea, man. Like, I recommend everyone does that. You'll get the most progression out of the game, uh, especially when convoys come by and pick you up. Let me just try and heal up here if I can. There we go, just healed up, awesome. Here comes someone else's bike right now. No worries at all. Just dropping my rockets down in these mobs. Constantly leveling up my weapons here as well. Great stuff. Now, I think Time Warpers is actually only $20 still, right? I, I'm not too sure if there's any discount or anything. But I do, I'm, yeah, I'm pretty sure that it is $20. I do think so, okay? So just keep that in mind. If you guys want to buy it now, you can. And you can add me on Steam and I'll play with you. My Steam username is GPV247, okay? I really do want to play with you guys, by the way, so don't be shy. Um, pop on Steam and add me if you guys want to play Time Warpers with me. This zone almost done. Yes, it is. Excellent. Where the hell's the last guy? Oh, they're flying enemies attacking me. Okay. That's it. That's all done. Awesome. There's a red butterfly. Got it. Great. There's a blue butterfly. Oh, yes. Come here, Bluey. Can't get to him, though. Cannot get to Bluey for some reason. No, I cannot. Yeah, got him. Nice. Let me activate my abilities, by the way. Just gonna use my abilities, by the way. Guys, I haven't really done that all episode. I'm just trying to save him, but that's okay. We won't bother about saving them. I've just activated my abilities. We've got uh, two rocket launchers firing at once right now. Also have increased gold chance as well. Or pretty much, uh, I, I know it's increased gold income. Auto fires on like I'm a turret, sort of. Anything I aim at, I shoot at automatically, which is great. Trying to take, take down those idiots in the sky. Nothing my turret takes them down. Yes, they did. All right, next stage. One enemy just sat there for some reason then. That was weird. Maybe because another player came by and cleared the area, perhaps. There's a butterfly. Got it, great. Don't know where the hell Bluey is in here. I'm not too sure, that's all right. I don't think I've already captured him, have I? No, surely not. It does say deposit though in the bottom left corner, I don't know why. A bit interesting, but okay. Just taking out the enemies instantly there with the splash damage, dude. Gotta love that, seriously. How good is splash damage, everyone? Rainbow mobs, awesome. Yeah, I never really thought I would have enjoyed Time Warpers when I first saw it. Like, it it looked cool, right? But I didn't think it would have this much, like, replayability, but it really does. Because the whole point is to keep on gaining uh, time cubes so you can time warp to purchase upgrades for yourself. Do you know what I mean? 
I just thought it was going to be like a, one of those games that gets repetitive very, very quickly, but it's honestly not. Um, I definitely recommend you guys play it. I can't stress enough, man. I don't know how many times I've said it this episode. Uh, probably three or four, but yeah, it's, it's amazing. Absolutely amazing game. Great job to developers. I back them all the way. Just trying to take down the mobs as much as I can here, as I said. We're on 245 right now. Just clearing house, pretty much. This horde has been wiped out completely. Excellent. What's this I got? Don't even know. What did I get? Just their maximum damage, apparently. Abilities activated again, by the way. I've just got them to automatically turn on now. The anything that spawns, we just take out instantly. <laughs> so powerful, the rocket launcher. It's ridiculous. Seriously, bro. Look at this. Carnage. There's a red butterfly. Can't get to it, though. Yes. I was actually lucky then. I did manage to get to it. Awesome. Mob spawn, instantly killed. Let's see how many, how many players are actually playing right now. 115 players playing right now, 6.27 p.m. Uh, Australian time, which is pretty late for all the Americans out there, definitely. Uh, so yeah, this, this game's still got players, bro. It's definitely growing, which is awesome. I might actually have to check out the Steam graphs and see how much players are actually have been playing the last week. Is it growing or is it staying the same? I'm not too sure. I'm, I'm hoping that it's growing. I really do hope the player base does grow, guys. It deserves it. I just wish that I had some people to play with right now, but yeah, that's the whole point. You guys add me on Steam, we'll play together, and yeah, you can be in the videos as well, obviously. You just gotta let me know when you wanna play. Pretty straightforward, man. There's a red butterfly there. Nice, got it. Taking down these Muppets straight away. <laughs> Love the rainbow mobs. What's down here? I'm always wondering what the hell's down these window ways. Nothing, apparently. Okay. Oh, God. Oh, wow. Did I get hit then? No, I don't think so. That was lucky. Far out. I just stood there and let the bullets come at me. Whoopsie. A lot of gold coins here as well. Fantastic stuff for us. Try and take them out. I will leave the game on tonight, though. As I said earlier, we'll see how far we can go. Hopefully, we can get to 2,000 for the first time. Uh... The best I've ever collected in one run is in the bottom right corner of the screen. 13,331 time cubes, everyone, which is great. Oh, got shot. Wow. The hell hit me? Must have flew into the enemies. Whoops. Just trying to understand the spawn patterns so I can shoot. There we go. Done. Great. I don't know why the game's freezing up like that. A lot of people have, are having issues with the game freezing and crashing, by the way. I think there's like a memory leak the developers said for now. They are trying to fix it though, I did hear. Shoot my rockets down there. Don't think they hit anything though. Convoy just went past then, or a couple of people on a bike, I think. Or was there only one guy, I'm not too sure. Okay, this is a rainbow stage. Yes, rainbow, hell yeah. Give me all that gold. I'm gonna try and click this red butterfly here. Got it, nice. Okay. So, the plan is now, hopefully we can beat this boss in one shot. Oh wait, we're still fighting, really? Just die already, you freaking punks. <laughs> Bloody time warpers, everyone, I swear. Okay, that's it, we're done. Good. Here we go, this is the boss. Let's do it. Boss is dead. Ah, there you go, everyone. That's what we like to see. <laughs> Fantastic stuff. Straight back onto the grind here. Nice, got that butterfly there as well. Awesome. So we've got Reddy and Bluey, I like to call them. Just trying to find Bluey. Bluey is the hardest one to find. Biggest pain in the ass possible as well. They're all dead. Four out of ten waves completed. Excellent. They spawn and they die. Okay, I probably shouldn't have scratched my head then. That's alright, there's a healing bay here. All good. See, they do try and kill you, these guys. They're not playing around. You stand still and you will die. A lot of bullets missed then. Sucked in. <laughs> Losers. Okay. Red butterfly I can see straight away again. Gotcha. No bluey though. Where the hell would the blue butterfly be, bro? I have no idea, for real. 
The mystery to me. I'm not even joking right now. I want to know. Just spam my rockets here. As soon as the enemy spawns, they die, hopefully. Of course, a copper bullet to the face. That is not ideal. Let's try and take them all out. Yep, all good. Yes, red butterfly. Gotcha. Thought I was a goner then. Didn't get hit. Sweet. Where's the butterfly? Nowhere around here? Nope. Nice background though. Far out, dude. Look at that. Pretty. As I'm getting shot at, by the way. I'm just admiring the view. <laughs> Gotta respect that. Okay. Should I switch up weapon, guys? See how we can do with the pulse pistol, maybe, eh? Just gonna use the default pistol quickly. See if we can dominate. We're actually doing pretty decently with the pistol. Wow. It's pretty powerful, man. Look at that. Pistol just kicked major ass then, dude. What the hell? Okay. No problems, game. Now, do I have cluster on, though, or anything? I do have cluster on. That's gonna be my rocket phase. This will be the pistol one. Do we have a damage increase? Yes, we do. Critical chance increase. Uh, we'll go gold increase, I reckon, hey? Just increase gold generation, by the way. Whoops, actually moved into the beans. My bad. Okay, got my dual pistols out right now. Killing everything that moves. Awesome. Look at that. No chance. Especially with auto fire active. There's a bluey. Wow, blue butterfly. First time in ages. Did I grab the red one on here? I don't think I did. Where the hell's ready now? There he is. Hello. Gotcha. Okay, here's a horde. Bluey, again. Wow, I'm, I'm getting lucky here, man. I can't collect him. Why can I not... What the hell? Why can I not collect him? Do I have to beat the horde, maybe? Must have to. Yeah, I got the time cubes, but I can't collect the blue one. I guess it said it's done. Apparently, I already collected it. Interesting. I don't remember how... I, like, I legit don't remember collecting anything. Got the red butterfly there, anyway. Nice. Oh, hello, everyone. <laughs> A little bit too close for my comfort there, but okay. Take these guys down. Awesome. Just auto-aiming right now. Pretty much, I feel like an aimbot, legit. Auto-fire, auto-aim. Cannot be beaten. It's a great feeling. Run zone, 256 right now. Cool. There is a healing bay there, by the way. Let me just quickly grab that. Healing up, healing up. Excellent. I cannot wait to see what the future holds for Time Warpers, by the way. It's going to be pretty good, man. Like... To think how far they come already in, a, in like the last month, not even. It's going to be sweet. Seriously. I cannot wait to see if they bring any new weapons in as well one day. I do hope so. I really do. These guys are just getting pumped right now. Look at this. Far out. They spawn instantly get owned. I love it how they're rainbow mobs though. It's good for me. <laughs> nice. They're all dead? Great. Alright. No problems. Look, what I'll do, everyone, here is wrap it up. Thank you all so much for watching today's Time Warpers episode. If you did watch the end, let me know. It would be a big achievement for me to actually keep someone watching for 25 minutes straight. Uh, but yeah, cheers again. I will catch you all next episode. Hopefully you all did enjoy. See you around, everyone. Just remember to hit that bell button. And yeah, this has been another episode of Gaming with Vince, of course. Uh, that's the pretty much the overall series now of my channel, Gaming with Vince. Every game I cover is going to be under Gaming with Vince, so keep that in mind. Hit the bell button to be notified when I post videos. Like, comment, do all that stuff. You guys know the deal. Discord's in the link below as well, okay? 